Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to a new video. So check this out, man. Your boy is an 85 overall in the 2K prelude. If you guys missed any of my previous videos, such as my in real life creation of my jump shot, uh, me going through my attributes on what I upgraded, you guys can go check those videos out. They are on my channel. But today, man, we're here to talk about my animations, man. We're here to talk about my dunks, my layups, my shots, my dribbles, man. We're here to talk about it all. So check this out, man. A lot of people always check out the gameplays and stuff like that and you know they watch you all year and honestly when you starting out man all your animations are all wrong you know you got to find that perfect balance but as far as dunks go I think my player is going to be doing very well because I found LeBron James dunk package and Russell Westbrook's dunk package those two dunk packages alone have the most ferocious dunks, tomahawks. I mean, animation, listen, it look crazy. All I'm saying is, if you guys wanna create a slash and shot creator, you can't do it without grabbing LeBron James and Russell Westbrook dunk packages. Their dunk packages make everything a little bit more fun. Now, um, as far as price goes, price, I won't say it's too high. I won't say it's too low. I mean, it's somewhere right there in the middle, but, uh, Russell Westbrook joint is is definitely up there. You know what I'm saying? It's, I'm guessing it's one of the best. You know what I'm saying? Because it's uh the one with all the flair, I guess you could say. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and purchase LeBron James and Russell Westbrook's uh, packages. Everybody else's, I don't think I'm gonna get them just yet. Uh, I did Zach Levine last year, but I'm not really too worried about Zach Levine right now. I'm, I want to see other animations this year, especially with an actual dunking uh character. Now, as far as layups go. A lot of people, you know, they like Steph Curry, they like Kyrie Irving, but honestly, the go-to layup package, the most cheesiest layup package has always been Russell Westbrook. If you're a player, whether you're a point guard, shooting guard, small forward, even for the people that get the glitches and all that, that do the power forwards and centers with the Russell Westbrook package, I mean, they're worth it. I, I, can't, I can't lie to you guys, man. Russell Westbrook package is really the best package in the game. Um, not only does it have contact layups to help you get and ones, but of course it has that cheesy scoop layup Like you know where the, the one where you blow by your defender you immediately jump and you're at the rim and All you're doing is a quick little layup scoop. So, you know, I, I like that one man I, I can't lie to you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and add that one to my cart I'm not gonna get any other layup packages just yet I'm gonna wait till the full game comes out get a feel for it probably might get something for my career because Russell Westbrook Layup package is not for my career. You know what I'm saying? My career, the computer somehow blocks them all the time. But uh, as far as dribble pull-ups, everybody know what the dribble cheese uh, pull-up was last year. That one now is called normal four. So if you want to get that cheesy pull-up jumper with a shot creator, normal four is the way to go. All right. Um, I'm not going to repeat that. Normal four. Okay. One last time. Normal four. <laughs> Now, I'm going to go ahead and check out right now. I got about almost 8,000 VC worth of stuff. going to go ahead and check that out and equip it as well so you guys can see it on screen. Dribble pull up is normal four. Um, I, didn't, I don't really worry about um, spin jumpers and all that stuff too much, but um, I will be using, uh, I guess, a couple video tutorials as far as like, say like Stax Montana might do one or something like that. I'll probably use what Stax Montana has as far as like spin jumpers and stuff like that. I won't probably pick anything on my own because usually most of the time Stax is right with the cheesy spin jumper. So I'll probably get that from him. Um, now let's go ahead and move on to uh, getting some more animations as far as dribbles. Dribbles every year are always crazy. Um, a lot of people have been going stupid over speed boosting right now trying to figure out what builds can speed boost. And I will tell you guys here first, I am not sure. If my player can speed boost, I'm not even sure if he can momentum dribble right now. At this point, I'm just grabbing dribbles and crossovers to make sure they fit my play style in the style that I had last year with my playmaking shot creator. Now, since I have a slashing shot creator small forward this year, it's much different. I'm not faster. Um, I'm definitely a lot slower. A lot of people say that me moving with the ball is so slow, but I'm not going to lie to you guys, man. Um, I played a game against the stars uh, in the prelude, which I'll probably be dropping in a couple days or maybe tomorrow or something like that. And I was doing pretty good with the dribbles. The dribbles was looking pretty good. Um, I didn't feel, you know, like I was in quicksand, but I know for sure that, you know, I tried to do as many possible combinations as I could. 
and I pulled a couple off. Um, as far as my moving hesitation goes, I wanted to do the moving hesitation that actually makes me look like I'm about to carry because that one is always the one that catches people the most because they don't know if you're about to shoot. You know what I'm saying? So when you're doing a moving hesitation and you do that little up fake, that get a lot of people to jump in the air. So you, most of the time I use the hesitation as a way to get some space. I'm not really one of those like dribble guy type guys. I don't just sit there and, you know, waste the clock down, use a whole bunch of stamina. I try to use the quickest moves to possibly get past you. That's that's my main goal on 2K. I don't want you to be in front of me. That's that's all I know. I don't care about making you fall eight times in one uh possession i just care about getting past you and getting to the rack or getting through you that's that's all i worry about now as far as like size up packages go man size up packages were pretty good um not really too much to it but i know that my size up package is definitely going to be something where i use that to try to get some space where you know we just trigger a couple animations together um i noticed that my stamina is pretty high at 85 overall so i don't think that stamina is going to be like a killer is just you know for them dribble guy people that love doing maybe chaining the same move together three four times they'll probably maybe be able to do it like two to three times now i did see a video where red city boy put out um uh stephen curry thing i'm not sure if he did it with um where he unlocked the stamina where it didn't deplete but he did this uh crazy chain of moves and he just kept spamming it back to back and i was like yo that is stupid but you know my player won't be able to do that i already know it i mean if my slash my slashing shot creator can do that stuff then hey i'm a happy man i'll go to red city boy and hit him up and ask him how he did it and you know just go over it um i heard that uh my man groundhard was trying to do it and he said he had to change his uh analog stuff to camera uh instead what was it uh camera relative instead of absolute because most of us 2k dudes we play on absolute so in order to pull off the move that red city boy was doing he had to change his to camera relative now as far as triple threat styles um my triple threat style was already equipped i didn't actually have to buy it so i was cool with that but triple threat size ups i can tell you guys right now for every person that creates a player they will spend the most time here this is where a lot of players are going to be trying to figure out like how to get them explosive straight off the jab step move sets uh the things that's going to trick the defender the most to get their ankles broken what type of moves you can chain out of the triple threat size ups like it's it's a lot man that's why i commend people that you know create like i say eight different accounts for 2k prelude and you know play with all different types of characters as well as those guys that create the one player they got on the 85 overall and they just spammed one game like they play four quarters one game tested out all their dribbles in a prelude quit the game go right back in and do it again i commend those guys because without them they we wouldn't know what to do like uh i think craig on twitter was uh doing that he was uh finding out about a, dump, a bunch of different builds um i'm davis was going crazy with his videos his videos is actually doing really really good as well like it's a lot of youtubers and twitch people and you know people on twitter that's showing love and trying to get everybody in in tune with how the community gonna work this year because we we honestly don't know what 2k is gonna do we just think like okay we we all balling out in the prelude but you know mike wayne and i'm saying that the game isn't gonna play like it did in prelude and things might change and all this so you know i really don't know what to expect from them so you know my thing is just you know keep my head on my shoulders make sure that i keep my purchases low <laughs> and make sure i hold on to the vc that i got so you guys are going to see all the dribbles that i pick here so make sure you know at the end of this make sure you guys get the screenshots so you know that whatever move sets i'm using and then you know you can try them out for yourself you know some of these worked last year but hopefully this year they work for my small forward man i just hope that i'm able to you know blow by bigger players if small forwards are 6 10 and up but i hope you guys enjoyed this video this is ikc signing out peace all right guys this is the end of the video i hope you guys definitely enjoyed this video make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and you can also watch one of my previous videos after hitting that subscribe button i hope you guys like this video let's get this thing to 5,000 likes and this is your boy ikc signing out peace